It took overtime, but the final home non-conference game for Washington State, a win over Texas State by five. Kevin O'Neill, Guy Haberman, what do you think of the Cougs tonight, Kale? You know, they've, they've got a ways to go, but as long as you got this guy, Josh Hawkinson, on your team, you're going to have a chance. He had 17 points tonight, 12 rebounds, 17 points on six field goal mm. attempts. He needs more touches. He puts you in a position as a, as a player where you can make a big-time play from the three-point line, two-point line. And Ike Rebu, I thought, was outstanding tonight. Maybe the best I've seen him play in two years. Did some good things defensively. Made some big shots down the stretch. Did a good job of running the team. He's athletic. He's strong. He's fast. Once his decision-making hits that really, really stable point, it's going to help Washington State make a big jump as a team. They had 18 points in the game on 7 of 11 shooting. You see the numbers, 6 rebounds, 4 assists. Amani Gant for Texas State, a career-high 24 points to go with his 7 boards. And how about Josh Hawkinson? You already said it, but he's been a double-double machine now with 6 this year. It's his 4th in a row. It's his 25th, uh, 26th for his career. And... Uh, it's more of the same for him. So up next for Washington State, off to Hawaii. Well, they'll take on Oklahoma. And then the season begins against conference play January 1.